my mind of a dead, you know, the dead one. Same again, mate. Mm. Mm. No, Tar, I've got to find Nick and explain what's going on in the factory. Oh, Ed, maybe you should take your lad with you. You know, just in case Nick gets angry. Oh, that, that's him now, excuse me. <laughs> but promise me you're not going to say anything. <laughs> no. Good. She's confused, it's no wonder. Sounds like vandals. The doctor said she can go home. Yeah. Then I'll let you get off. I'll be in touch if we have any more questions. Thank you. The policewoman's right, sweetheart. You need to stay away from fires. Come here, you. Come on, let's get this party started. See ya. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to get the door closed. It's going to be a cold night, and I don't want any more heat to escape. Oh, this... this isn't right. You're all alone. Oh, as is my lot. Now, don't you worry about me. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Mary. <sighs> well, it's the least I can do. Just one more suitcase to bring across. <laughs> really? Another one? Mm. My stamp collection. As a child, I dreamt of visiting each and every one of the countries on those stamps. Such things as dreams are made of, as Mr Shakespeare so eloquently put it. Mm. I'll show it to you if you want. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, cheers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, this won't do. The boxes won't move themselves. Oh, no, no. Don't you worry about that. Mm. Didn't you say that you had a, um, you wanted to get that suitcase packed first? Good idea. Enjoy. Getting to know your new house.